All right, y'all, welcome back. So we're out here at a new spot. As you can see, the sun is just getting ready to set, so it's actually pretty late. Uh, I guess I shouldn't say late because the sun sets early now. It sets at like 6.45-ish. Um, but we're out here at our spot. You can see I've got the new truck. I've got both my kayaks out here. Kyle's out here with his wife. He's getting uh, the site paid for. And then there's gonna be a couple other folks that show up. Uh, Michael and his wife are coming tomorrow. He's been in a video from All Dogs and then there's some other people I have no idea who's showing up. But uh, I brought out the big old pop-up tent, which is right here. So I need to get this thing out and get it set up. It shouldn't take long let him pick out where he's going to park at since they're all running rooftop tents and stuff because i think everybody is but uh yeah we're gonna hang out we'll be here for two nights uh so i don't know if i'll even do a lot of filming tonight uh, i just brought a sandwich to eat for dinner and we'll just see where the where the video takes us we'll do some fishing obviously i brought a few different poles with me and uh we'll just see how this all turns out stay tuned y'all got dark as I was getting this all set up but we're done um, got a table in there all my junk a couple of coolers and I guess we can go in here oh yeah the little folding table that was sent in we've got a couple of totes of junk a little bit of food cooking gear the little ones full of beer that's got food in it and then back here, I've got my other junk. So I brought my full cot. Uh, underneath of that, I did, uh, sorry about the lighting. I did just grab my mat and a sheet set out of the truck. So that'll be really comfortable. A bag of clothes, laundry basket that I had the mat rolled up inside of, but it works as a little table. A battery box and backpack. That's it, big old tent. You guys will see more of it in the morning. I just got the fire going. So we're gonna head out here. Make sure this stays zipped up. We do have lots of bugs out here, but he's all set up over yonder, waiting on a couple more people. He's making some food. And fire's rolling. I'm dripping sweat. So I'm gonna drink a beer and then. I got a sandwich or something for dinner tonight that we'll get to. We're just gonna hang out, y'all. I'll see you later. Good morning. The sun's coming up behind me. I gotta get up and pee. So, I think it's time to just get up and make some coffee. It's gonna be cold out there. My phone says it's 50 degrees, so. Oh, I slept good in here though. It's nice being able to stand up. hunting season around here so there's lots of gunshots this morning it's got to be like the 25th or 30th gunshot I've heard I think I need to get another dually whopper for that Thank <laughs> you. 
I got some mini muffins. Have some of these. Sure, I have another bottle in the truck. Old truck, anyways. Rocking the Walmart cup, right? With the Yeti lid. Because that's how we roll. I stole the Yeti wood from my wife because I'm the cheap guy. I think they're rolling around and they're getting getting woke up probably by me and the dogs I guess but anyways it's supposed to be a nice day out I think 70s um, I don't have anything to do all day so my only goal is to go take a kayak out see what happens with that Tiny little muffins. All right, guys. Uh, it's been a couple hours. We've been up an hour or so. There's a spot that's down by the water. So we're packing up and we're gonna move down there. It's just down the hill. So I'm not gonna fold the tent up. Uh, but I'll throw my stuff in the truck and then we'll just take the stakes out and we should be able to walk it down there. Uh, me and Kyle should be able to handle that. But yeah, we're going to get that stuff and then we'll be right in front of the lake. And uh, it'll be a lot easier to launch kayaks and whatnot. Well, there's the lake. It's a little overgrown, so no fishing right here. But we got to walk down here. Um, Kyle's going to be coming down. So we've got a fire pit here. So I'll probably move this over a little bit more, but... We'll let him get down here and get his stuff set up and get mine moved. What well, two of us just carried it down, one on each side. Should have filmed some of that, but it's whatever. I don't think I even showed you guys since the last video. But you put a pumpkin head up there. It looks pretty level, level enough. That's well, big, but you can move it with two guys all the way down a hill. I gotta get it staked down right here. All right. Ground's a little softer over here.
want to get in, I can kind of hold it steady. Nope, 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 nope. Hey. Okay, come here. You ready to go for a yak trip? Come here. Water's right cold. Baby. It's probably very cold. Come here. Go back. Come here. If you get in it, I can just shove you out. Oh, that's cold. Yep, that's, that's really cold. And the speed thing are adjustable, and your chair can move it a couple inches back and forth. So, however you need to. Any? The doggos aren't too excited. Then we're leaving them. Oh shit, I didn't even see they had a boat. What's that? I didn't even see that they had a boat over here. Yeah, Alright y'all, well we paddled all the way to the dam. Uh, I don't really have anything good set up. This, this has probably been tied on this rod for like two or three years now yeah we're right here at the dam and the wind's kind of blowing that way so it should blow us back to camp but the water level is also very low uh, we're on the dam and it's five foot I didn't see anything over six foot this whole time I don't think we're gonna have much luck catching anything but I did bring a beer so it doesn't really matter yeah, five foot deep, that's crazy. What's up? It's crazy that it's only five foot deep out here. Like I could literally stand up in this. Yeah. Oh, there's something big right underneath of me though. Yeah. Oh, is that a fish finder? Yeah. It is. Do you just have these hanging on your side? Yep. Might actually be a bit deeper over here because this spillway thing is right over there. Right there. But the water can't even get through there. It's so low right now. Water four feet. <laughs> a big one on screen. I don't know if you guys can see it. Two foot down right underneath of me. Come eat this dude. Oh, there we go. Oh, dang, I got hit. Damn, he hit it twice, too. All right, y'all, well, I suck at fishing. I think that's been pretty obvious in the recent videos. We didn't try too hard, either. Uh, we paddled around, sipped a beer, and we're gonna head back in. I think a couple people have shown up with another, another rig. One of the rigs that's showing up today, I'm kind of excited to show you guys about. I think it's pretty neat. In fact, I might actually make a separate video on it just to show it to you guys because I don't know if there's another one that exists like that. Nope. So it's pretty cool. We'll check that out too. Uh, but we're gonna head back in and hang out. You can leave the kayak down here too. Yeah, that's fine. That way if anybody else wants to go out, they can just take them. Okay. Don't fall. Yeah. Or do, I got the camera rolling. I got too many, I got too much shit in my hands. I'm good, I made it. Sketchy. <laughs> good bounce. All right, now pull me in. 
don't know if you'll be able to pull my fat ass up there. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Alright, get this shut off. Don't kill my batteries. Grab my junk. Well, the sun's starting to go down, guys. We've been hanging out since we came back from fishing and uh, played some card games. My wife came and hung out for a little while. Uh, but we've got everybody's here now. We've got Enoch, Dahlia, Michael, and Robin, and they've got their rigs out here. Um, you probably recognize that tent. And then we're probably going to do a full separate walk around of this rig because it deserves it, I believe. But I'll give you a sneak peek of that. Quick. And then what's your... Oh, here you guys can check them out yeah, on right Instagram. Yeah. Bye -bye. But Ow. there ain't no roof in here. So there's a full rooftop tent up there. So you guys will have to stay tuned for that. We'll do a full video on that one at some point in the future. But yeah, we're hanging out. Kyle's going to make us some dinner so I don't have to cook tonight. And uh, we'll get ourselves a fire going later. Stay tuned, y'all. Won't dirty a plate up, but we're gonna eat some of this chicken. Go away, fly. <laughs> the tailgate cover is nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely, definitely worth the money, even though I didn't pay for it, but I still would have bought one. I'm just doing a little chicken taco here. Nothing fancy, nothing crazy. But I didn't have to cook, so that's nice. <laughs> Gotta make breakfast. Thief. Then we're gonna do so some Los Calientes on there. Can't say if I had this before or not, but. <laughs> Right? <laughs> I hope there's enough for everybody. Never enough. enough. We got some pupusas. We got bacon and eggs and tortillas and cheese. Thank you, Kyle. Yep. That's good. That works. Mm hmm. The Los Calientes does have a decent there. kick to it. <laughs> How much was it? 109. It was 20% off. It was like 250 regularly. I know, I ate them all day today. Jesus! You keep going to work? You didn't go to work. I kind of went to work. No, but you went to work. What do you mean? Go take pictures? Well, it's the next morning, y'all. Um, we all hung out by the fire. And battery door popped open crashed out after the fire went dead um, it's a beautiful morning out but everybody's already starting to get their stuff packed up in fact somebody's already started their rig yeah I think Mike's ready so I'm gonna get my junk packed I'll probably get on the road here I got a lot of stuff to pack up obviously Yaks and tent and whatnot. Having a truck hamper or a van is really nice at these points because all you gotta do is get in and go. Well, there we go, we're all loaded up. It's a little full. But it all fits. You can't tell. All right, I'm gonna get out of here. In a quarter mile, turn left onto. Without shaking too much, I guess. There we go. All right. Well, we got out of there. I got to set my whole tent up again when I get home because, of course, it's wet. But I stopped here at Casey's and grabbed some breakfast. I was supposed to make breakfast this morning. Breakfast this morning. Uh, 
but nobody was really feeling it. Everybody was just kind of ready to get out of there this morning. Um, and so I didn't have to make breakfast. Oh, rubber floors. A little bit of hash browns. And then we picked up a bacon, egg, and cheese croissant. Shove this in and have a second coffee for the morning. It was a good time out camping. Uh, it's probably like we're not going to have much nice weather left. Uh, it was cool to meet uh, Enoch and Dahlia. Oh, mm. I didn't really shove the camera in his face much, but we'll get a full walk around video of that rig because it's pretty rad. Everything he's done to it. And he's not done with it yet, but it's definitely motivating. Uh, I really want to get this thing done. I just got to get it figured out. It's too bad I'm not built like a stripper. <laughs> Make some quick cash. <laughs> but as far as that goes, y'all, I think I'm just going to go ahead and close it out there. Um, I had some parts show up for the truck in the mail while I was gone. So maybe we'll do that on the next one. We'll see. Halloween is coming very quickly. And I've got a decent idea for a video we can make for that, which should be pretty interesting. So, And as we get to the end of the month here, I usually do a live stream at the end of the month. So watch for that. We'll see when we get that done. But... Yeah, I appreciate you guys watching. We'll get back to some solo camping probably on the next video. And as always, stay tuned for the next adventure. I'll see you in a bit. I'll... No, no.